Hi, what's up guys, it's the Pace and in this video I'm going to show you how to install TWRP and unlock bootloader of Redmi Note 3. Now before proceed, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe us and hit the bell icon to get notifications about all of future videos. Now if you've done that, let's get started. Now first of all, you have to download all these three files from link in the description of video. Once you download, you have to install the ADV driver on your PC. Now once you install the ADV driver on your PC, you have to extract both the file in your device. Now once you extract both the file, you have to go to your device, then go to settings, then go to out phone. Here you will get the MIUI version and you have to tap 7 times on MIUI version. You will get a developer option enabled and you have to go back again to settings menu and here you have to go to additional setting and inside the additional setting you will get a developer option now you have to go to developer option and here if this thing is already not enabled then you have to enable it first then you will get a option called oem unlocking now you also have to enable oem unlocking option now once you done that you have to go to mi account and sign out to your account now once you run that, you have to turn off your device. Now once your device is turned off, you have to press volume down and power button together to open a fast boot mode. Now once your fast boot mode is started, you will get the bunny icon on your device. Now you have to connect your device with USB cable to your computer. Now go to this MI flash with ID folder and here you will get all this file. Now first of all you have to install the MI flash setup file. Now I already installed it so I am not gonna install it again. Now if you don't want to install the TWRP recovery in your device then you can skip this installation part. Now if you just want to unlock the bootloader of your device just run this reboot batch file. It will open a command window in your device. You have to press enter or anything else to close it. And your device will be in downloading mode. Now the red LED of your device is start blinking. It means it is in download mode. Now once your device is in download mode, you have to go to PC again and search for MI flash tool. And this is the same thing that we installed earlier in your device. Now go to option called select. Here you have to select the folder that we extracted earlier. Now you have to go to the parent directory of the images folder. Now here you can see that I am going to select the parent folder of the images folder that is twrp underscore jcx and you have to click on ok. Now click on refresh it will show your device here and now make sure that you have to select the option called save user data. Now once you select that you just have to simply click on the flash button. It will start the flashing of twrp recovery in your device. Now this may take up to 2 minutes and once you see the success message that means everything is done. Now you have to press the volume up and power button in your device to start TWRP recovery. Now you have to press these two button until you see the MI logo. Now this will start the TWRP recovery in your device. First time it may take time. Now if you want to remove USB cable, you can remove it. Once your TWRP recovery is started, you will get everything in Chinese. So you have to follow exactly the same step that I am going to show you. You have to select this option. Then select this global option or globe type this icon here at the right corner of your device. You have to select it. And once you select this option, you will get all the language that is supported by this TWRP recovery. And you can change your language whatever you want. Now this is all about the installation part of TWRP. You can install custom ROM or anything you want. If you don't want, you just go to reboot and just reboot your system. Now after installation, the first boot of your device may take up to 5 minutes. So you have to wait until your device is started. Now here you can see that you will not gonna lose any data of your device in this method.
guys that's it for this video i hope you like it don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notifications about all the future videos now this is the best signing out meet you soon in next video